All right, we got the stage strike. They stripped a battlefield because apparently Falco just gets to win this counter, this uh, stage counter pick. Because I think this is just well, I don't think it's gonna matter in this situation. <laughs> Oh, it's, oh, there he goes. This reminds me of the time I had to play uh, Terrence on stream. <laughs> there was nothing to be learned that day. We got lasers flying everywhere. That's pretty good, sour, oh, no, it Go to shower headbox. So we got shout outs to um, Leaf. Oh, he's dead. Uh, well, he might have another chance for cover here. Yeah, he just does the does the right thing, rolls up. He's <laughs> doing the West. That was a good damage there. Good placement of these lasers. This is an interesting pl laser placement, but undeniably effective against Falcon. He's putting the lasers as high as possible, it looks like. <gasps> the one thing that Reed wants to avoid doing is, like, becoming predictable with his approaches. Because Flyer Dog will eat that up. And one thing that he's doing really well is he's not... He's being really unpredictable with his tech options. Oh, that might do it. Oh. He tries to get that up B and looks close, but yeah, it's never gonna work. Oh! Really leads recovery really good this set. Yeah. So that's a great recovery option because you can do that fast fall whenever you want to mix up the timing on whatever option Falcon chooses to edge guard with. This should be as simple as uh <laughs> oh, someone someone help him! <laughs> somebody help him, he needs some milk! Flat Talk takes first game. That boy needs his cals. Some good calcium. Uh oh. Oh, the mash out. Yo, fun fact. A stock difference can uh, affect how soon you can mash out. I didn't know that until the other day. But yeah, if you're if you're down in stocks, it's easier to mash out. <laughs> Man, some interactions would, in this game would just look super funny. IRL. That's pretty good. Shine back here. Can't get across the stage quick enough to get the edge guard though. And really he's just gonna look for some some stray hit to knock him off stage. Oh a laser! <laughs> this is like the last thing I would have expected. Another down air or a back air probably would have been just fine there. Nair might have killed. Yeah, difficult position for Reed and Flower Dog takes the opportunity to do a stock trade while he's at nearly 200. Good awareness from Flower Dog to know we had the opportunity to do that suicide option. He's already looking like a better counter pick for Reed. He's keeping up with Flower Dog a lot better. He's choosing um, better mix-ups in, uh, in the neutral in order to avoid getting grabbed. Because that's where he, he really starts to get messed up. You can see this talking like the grab or Nair. Oh! That's good option coverage for Reed. Oh, the laser! Okay, that was sick. Dude, Reed's been practicing, boy. Oh my god. Rick, Rick trying to find some space. Rick clearly not comfortable in that, like, firefight. 
Yeah, that'll do it. I don't know how he knew that wasn't gonna hit him. I guess that might have just been a, a leap of faith type of thing. But we're clipping that. <laughs> An opportunity for Reed to take a game off Flower Dog. He's been playing really, really well today. Probably better than I've ever seen him. Go! Oh! Had him on the ropes, and then sometimes you just get hit with a knee, and that's it. Good shit from Reed, though.